Okay, y'all. So let's go ahead and get straight into this curly hair routine. Here's a mess. Hair hasn't been washed in about like two weeks, maybe. I don't even know how long I haven't washed my hair, but it's been a while. So let's just go ahead and get to washing this hair. It needs to be detangled, needs to be washed, shampooed, and it needs to be styled. It needs to be just, it just needs some help, okay? Yeah, it needs some help. I do wash my hair in the shower when I'm taking a shower. I like guess the best way for me, I can really like get in there and like really scrub when I shampoo and stuff. So first, I like to go ahead and detangle. So I just put my hair down the middle. It doesn't have to be perfect. My hair is very tangly right now, so it's kind of hard to do that. Use any clip to just clip the other side up. I use any detangling brush. Honestly, this one I just started using is from Curls Queen. It came with my curly extensions. Stay tuned for when I do the sponsorship by them. Just like to take this hair out, actually. I like to take the hair out of my brush too to see how much hair I lost while detangling. Just to see. I never, never detangle my hair dry. I like to detangle my hair very, very soaking wet. I need to go ahead and move my floor mat because of how bad my hair is still leaking from my black hair dye. So first I like to go ahead and wet it. So now that my hair is wet, I like to detangle with conditioner. I'm just using this Shea Moisture Hydrate Repair Conditioner. I never use this one, but I wanted to try something new. With conditioner and shampoo, I really don't use like a set conditioner shampoo. I kind of just use any one that I have at the moment. I don't know. I'm just not really big on like a specific shampoo and conditioner. This, the conditioner really moisturizes it and makes it so much easier to detangle through. I always start from the ends with the tingling and then I just wake my way up. Ooh, my hair already looking better. I go ahead and do the other side. My hair is detangled on both sides all the way through. Now I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up and let's go ahead and get in the shower. Okay, y'all, so I'm out of the shower. Hair is freshly washed. I put a towel over it because I really don't like water dripping down my back. That was my first time using the conditioner I showed you, the Shea Moisture one. And my hair actually smells pretty good from it. But this is how my hair is looking. There's no product, just a little bit of conditioner, barely any. And I just go ahead and start styling my hair. So I was gonna do like a half a pad down, but I was like, let me just do my hair down. I never really wear my hair down, and I'm like, why not do my hair down, especially if I'm filming. A curly hair routine it's like only right for me to do my hair down depending on where you want to party i'm just going to party down the middle i've never actually tried wearing my hair down with a side part i'm not trying today but i will try one day i always lose my rat tail combs like i need to just buy like a whole bin of them honestly off of like team or something first we're gonna do by sections i start off with like a little tiny section it just doesn't really matter honestly the key to like really good like defined not frizzy hair you have to do your hair with wet hair and re-wet my hair especially by the roots and then i'm gonna go ahead and detangle it back through if your hair isn't dripping wet your hair is not wet enough curls will be looser like right here but the roots that are growing out will be a little puffier so the way to get them to not be puffy i'm gonna go ahead and go straight in with this born to repair defining cream by carol's daughter now i've used just this product before and oh my gosh yeah it literally like works so good like i could literally just use this product but i'm not going for that kind of like that look today now this pillow soft curls is, is literally perfume for your hair i said this so much when i'm doing my girl hair with that product it's literally perfume for your hair bro like it smells so good literally smells so good and it works so good too so now i'm gonna go in with this meal pomegranate and honey quail custard with a good defined and like not frizzy look you really need a good gel i go in i take a little bit and i put it straight i put it on the roots 
mainly and then i just kind of like drag it down some but the roots is where you really want to target it at. so now that i went in with those products i'm gonna go ahead and go with some eco just some extra like strength gel so you know my roots does not puff up so i just go ahead and put that on my roots and then i just put it throughout my hair and then brush again and then i look through it and make sure that it's no frizzy pieces your hair looks really really defined it's no frizz really anywhere that means you're done you can go ahead and move on to the next section i'm gonna do this to the rest of my head and i will see y'all in a second Okay, y'all, so I'm done with this side of my hair. It's very, very, very wet, very, like, like, look. If your hair don't sound like that, it's not going to turn out perfect. This is how it looks. Now I'm going to go ahead and do the other side, and I'm going to get back to y'all when I'm done. Okay, y'all, I am done with both sides. My hair looks super defined, very wet. Yep. So now I'm about to go ahead and diffuse this. I'm gonna diffuse it off camera. So I'm gonna see y'all when I'm done and my hair is fully dry. Okay. Oh okay, yeah. I know my hair still looks like soaking wet, but it's actually 80% dry actually, and that's just because of how much gel I used. I'm about to go ahead and do my edges. So I feel like edges really tie together the whole hairstyle. Okay, so I'm gonna clip my hair back some. It's crazy how wet my hair looks. It's literally like almost dry. I'm gonna just clip it back some on this side. And then basically just take out the edges that I want to be taken out. So I put some eco, but I also put a little bit of edge booster. Okay, y'all, uh, so my edges are done. I, I had blow dried them actually instead of putting my scarf on. Because y'all know I put my scarf on to like let them dry, but actually I blow dried them. And they actually turned out pretty good. So now I'm going to go ahead and go in with this side. It's crazy because I never do curly hair content on my channel anymore. But I literally grew my platform on Instagram with curly hair content. Because I used to do uh, like curly hair tutorials. And like just hair tutorials in general on my page. And now it's crazy because I never do curly hair content. And it was really mainly because I had, you know, had the incident with my hair getting like really damaged from like one straightening both sides are done yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and blow dry this side and i just pray that my hair turns out right because i wasn't gonna wear my hair down because i knew i wasn't gonna end up liking it but it's okay because i'm about to go ahead and blow dry it okay y'all so my edges are done on both sides let's see, shut up and yeah my hair is looking very cute very defined okay y'all so to help with the frizz and just like anything else i'm gonna take this dream coat wow and just spray it all on my hair and then i'm gonna also take this coconut penetrating oil it smells really good and it also reduces frizz take this on both sides it's crazy how wet my hair looks when my hair is literally like almost 100 percent dry and of course it needs to dry a little bit more. So I'm gonna come back with my hair is when my hair is like 100% dry, okay? Okay, y'all. So here is how my hair turned out. I freaking love it. It looks so good. It's so defined, so soft. It looks wet, but it's actually 100% dry, which is crazy. If you guys have any questions, don't be afraid to ask them in the comments. And I just love the way my hair turned out real cute. I will be wearing my hair down more because I need to. And it's like, I don't know why I don't wear my hair down as much as I should be. But anyways, hopefully y'all enjoyed today's video and today's wash day slash curly hair routine. And I will see y'all in my next video. And happy Vlogmas and stay tuned for more videos. Subscribe down below so y'all can stay tuned for more videos. Bye y'all.